Hey guys, Crayfish Carl here, and welcome to another Droplet States of Matter update. Early Access 1.33 is now available. This update gives a refreshed look at the Sobek boss fight. While the fight itself remains relatively the same conceptually, I've graphically updated the arena to match the narrative changes from the previous version. The area just outside the boss fight has a minor atmospheric sequence where a series of torches light up as you approach Sobek's temple. The inside of the arena uses similar visual scene in the sandswept city level to better imply the two locations are part of the same world. You'll also find Sobek to be lip synced to his dialogue, which now features some appropriate cartoonish movements. I not only changed the graphics, but also some of Sobek's behaviors. In addition to a new beam attack, the way Sobek summons enemies to his aid works much differently than before. Depending on where you are in the arena, either mummies or golden scarabs will spawn. When defeated, they will drop lemonade and burgers respectively so that you can refill your health and ammo during the fight. In a pinch, you can switch between Droplet and Molecule so that you can take over while the other gets a chance to rest. The last major change was that the essence of Bra that spawns during the fight is no longer random. They will now spawn in a fixed order around the arena so that time trial challenges are more predictable on repeated attempts. In other news, I did a minor once-over across the Haunted Shipyard level. I've rearranged all the atoms and enemies, as well as a few of the puzzles to improve the flow. While the level can be beaten more quickly than before, its pacing is now consistent with all the other levels in the game. That's all for now, and with that, thank you for following the development of Droplet States of Matter. 